Some little Xbox yes. action down here. Yes, controller. Yeah. What did you have on the controllers? Uh, $7 each. $7 each? Okay. A little much for me. Oh, 15, uh, I do love GameCube stuff, but 15 is tough. Yeah, I mean, it's a good game, though. it would have to be a pretty decent discount, I got the honestly. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, wow. Well. Really, dude? Really, you're just shoving your camera right into my shot? <laughs> you're filming. Okay, yeah, likely story. This man's dude, trying this to sabotage. Like, look at this. This is the face of sabotaging another YouTube channel. You so many subscribers already. <laughs> you're just trying to siphon some. Please come over and hang out with me, too. <laughs> I just like I just like the GameCube stuff. You buy, if you buy, if you buy a bunch, I'll make you, I'll cut you, I'll cut you a deal. Okay. How much are the ones that don't have a price? <laughs> Five. What kind of a deal? What kind of a deal would you work if I bought all all six of these? Eighty dollars. Eighty dollars, so like ten off. Yeah. Um, I was gonna be more in like the sixty range, but if that's too low, that's all right. Uh, about seventy. I'd probably I'd probably have to do sixty, but again, I don't want to squeeze you too much if that's too low. Or what about seventy, and I'll throw another one in there. Does that work? Okay, not too expensive. You want me to pick it? Okay, how about this? Uh, this guy, 15 for 70. Does that work? Okay, I'll go 70. Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. you guys have a good one. All right, folks, so we got seven GameCube games, $70. Not a bad deal. Definitely the kind of place that everyone pretty much expects to haggle. And uh, we were definitely on the border of having to walk away from that, but you know, there's, there's nothing crazy in here, but since they're all complete, I'm all right paying up a little bit. So, All right, so Ricky, what did what did you get at that exact same booth that I was haggling so hard at? <laughs> Gun Valkyrie, and he said anything that wasn't didn't have a tag on it was five bucks. So I was Dude, like, I'll take it. <laughs> yes, because how how much is that guy worth? It's like a forty five dollar game. Let's go, man. <laughs> I was I just had blinders on for the GameCube stuff, man. This series has done something to me. <laughs> it's the GameCube blindness. Yep. So this guy, this is not something you see every day at the swap meet. Holy cow. Give him a bit to set up. Yeah. Okay, so this definitely is the first stuff that catches my eye. The handhelds, unfortunately. Definitely, I mean, a hundred bucks for DS lights. Like, that's more than I can get after fees. So there would have to be a lot of wiggle room for negotiation. But I mean, I would, I would be willing to buy a lot, but I'm not the most optimistic. So editor Riff, yes. I didn't even tell the people where the heck we are. <laughs> we are. I'm at, so I'm so intent on the, slicing off my intros to be as short as possible. And I, and I, I didn't even do one. <laughs> we are in Orange County, California, um, great part in Southern California, only about 10 minutes from the beach, and this is the Orange County Swap Meet. Iconic Pixel Game Squad stomping grounds right here. If you guys don't already know, we're trying to we're trying to get those good deals before heading back to the expo this afternoon. All right, we got some got some more game action here. Oh, looks pretty picked through, if I'm not mistaken. Let me know if I'm missing anything here. And just like that, folks, they all left me in the dust. Uh-oh, games have been spotted. Time to get ahead of these jokers. Block them out with the body. Okay, okay. Ooh, I see a little GameCube memory card there is interesting. Uh-oh, I see some more GameCube. You guys already know what I'm looking for. Just dan Dance Dance Mario mix. Ooh, Herbs is actually decent. That one's kind of a come up, I think. Oh, we got some top scratching on the disc though. Dang it. Ooh, here's another one, folks. Sims. Is this in decent shape? It is. It's missing the manual. But yeah, check that out. Yeah, the lowest Prime listing is 34. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Harry sure Potter. That, that, that oh man, that guy's kind of undercutting everybody else. But yeah. once that guy sells out at 14, it'll go up to 38. So eight is a great deal. Return of the King. Okay, one is seven, one is 10. We'll have to ask about that. Oh yeah. Lowest copy is 18 after fees for both of these. If I bought a decent number of these GameCube games, would you work me a deal? I might I might even buy more if the price is right. 25 you'd do? Okay, so, so a little bit off if I buy a decent number. Avatar for 10, that's complete, we'll do that. Haunted Mansion, I'll pass on. Oh, 
All right, so you said 25. I threw this one in. Would you do 30? 32. 32? All right, that works. Appreciate that. Could I could I look through some of these and see the prices? Um, What about this GameCube? Yeah. It's, uh, 12. All right, guys. See you later. Have fun. Be good. Thanks, Dad. What about how much is Fire Red? The same 35. 35? Yeah. Could I take a look at that? The condition? What did you? What were you asking on the 3DS there? A hundred thousand. A hundred? I would take a look at that. Does it have a charger? Oh, it's got the stylus too. All right. Uh, would you do ninety? Your it's a hundred. I can. It, it hundred firm. Yeah. Um, if it's got the charger, I'll do a hundred. Yeah. Thank you. All right, folks second time finding GameCube games at the swap meet? What, is this like the Twilight Zone or something? That's crazy. Also picked up that uh, 3DS regular. It was super clean. Normally, I like to be at under 100 for those if I can, uh, but also make like 30 bucks on it. It'll be super quick and won't require any cleaning. I already tested it, so I'm good to go. Now, if I can just manage to find where my friends went. There it is, folks. The deal of the swap meet just went down on top of that car in box. Beatles rock band. Ricky, Where are you going? tell me, dude, what did you get that thing for? So that rock band, they wanted 60, so I just offered 50. They wanted 60, so you offered 50? And yeah. what are the comps, dude? What's it going for? <laughs> Ricky always feels like a 280 bad guy. to 300. 280 to 300 with no box. Dude, that's a come up. That's a come up of the day. So far, dude, this is just this man. He just sped ahead while I was trying to make five dollars a piece on GameCube games. He's just he's making a hundred and fifty dollar profit at one go. Hello, I like money. I'm not even mad because I couldn't have gotten it back on the plane, so I'm happy for you, dude. <laughs> Good try, though. All right, I gotta say, this booth is pretty sick. Look at this. Look at this Mega Charizard Y plush 17. Seems like Kinda high quality, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what you are. Oh, Despicable Me. Yo, Hatsune Miku? Okay, they're getting a little, they're getting a little obscure with it, I like it. Ooh, he's honing in on all the Sonic plushes over there. Someone loves Sonic. <laughs> What's up, internet? Retro here, who remembers naked Barbies and getting, I was in the middle of a punchline riff. Dang, I'm so oh. sorry. Don't you know it's Caleb Pipe? Who remembers naked Barbies and getting an Indian burn from your older brother? That is so 90s nostalgia. Dude, that sounds cool. I'm going to use it in my video. Who remembers Rugrats? <laughs> By the way, Riff, just wanted to say thank you for editing this footage as we speak. I'm doing it as we speak. Yeah, Money. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is actually a really nice bag that I'm kind of thinking about because I could definitely use a better one <laughs> to bring all my games back in. We'll see. How much is this guy? 20 for that? Did you take 15? 20 farm? All right. I don't know, folks. I just like getting discounts so much, but this is honestly a nice bag. You'd never think this, right? Joy-Con charging grip? Yep. I'm pretty sure these go for money. I'm gonna look it up and make sure. Yep, there it is, folks. 25 on this, 41 after fees in used condition on Amazon. This is the kind of stuff you gotta find. All right, Rick beat us to the GameCube games over here. Let's see, did he leave anything good for us? I honestly kinda wanna make this the third booth that we buy GameCube stuff from today. Rampage complete for 18, definitely could be worse. All right, and Lord of the Rings Return of the King for 12 is also a decent deal. So we're gonna see if we can bundle all this up. So on these three, if I bought these, you had 55 on them. Would you swing a deal for me? 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Uh, sure, I'll do that. I actually, I saw something over there that I might like too. Si yo compre unos de ellos, me daría por 10 cada una. Cuatro? Cuatro? Okay. Bueno, gracias. Alrighty, 
so 10 a piece on those and 50 for this stack not too bad these ones are a little rough but i think that'll clean up okay all right so rick just scored in there i thought i scored rick really scored um and we we're looking through and i saw this guy and uh -huh. i was like yeah. i am fairly certain i'm no weed yeah. expert no that's but there's the one like, there's like five like, yep. kind of weird the, well, kitty games. cruisers and, and uh -huh. it was like is it like, like, like 180 180 to yeah so right around the 200 mark and then yep. we this was only this is for about 50 to 55 yeah we're like still. let's just get it yeah it's sealed <laughs> well, let's just get it so here's my method so this is what i always tell big hint to everybody who's hunting i've been doing this yep. for a decade it's almost scary for me when you know something's a good deal to hold up just the item yep, yep. i almost was like just grab something exactly not ripping off we're paying what they asked we didn't ask for a bundle deal yep but just like we're getting games <laughs> you know like i was i was gonna give you a hard time for not haggling <laughs> but now i see why he asked and i literally said don't like my yeah. conscience got to yeah me. yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> we're already well and that was actually exactly what i was thinking with i got like a a controller charger and a couple gamecube games i didn't want to ask for a discount on the charger until i found a couple other things because folks tip of the day a lot of people, a lot of resellers out there are a little bit simple-minded. They'll go into a booth like that, see two games that are overpriced, and walk out, be like, that guy, there's no business to be done. What you have to do, folks, do your due diligence, scan a lot of stuff, find three things that are underpriced, and then work a bundle deal suddenly you're actually making some decent margins. <laughs> Ricky's, Bye, getting, Ricky's getting a profit and a workout all in one. I love it, dude. <laughs> all right, folks. Here's the haul for the day. We got an actual stack of GameCube games at the swap meet. My mind's still blown. Sweet Joy-Con charging grip. These guys are a little bit rough, but at 10 bucks a piece, I'll probably get 25 a piece after fees once I clean them up. And then this guy, the excellent condition, regular 3DS. Thank you guys for watching. And until next time, we will catch you on the flip. flip.